All right, good morning, everybody. This is the, or evening, um, it's morning for me right now. It is currently nine degrees out, so I am uh, gonna do this demo in the garage with the door open and car running. Um, this is kind of what everybody's been waiting for. Um, I'm gonna start it from the very beginning and show you what the boot up is. the boot up and this is uh, just extremely clean um, the video it doesn't show it like what I'm seeing so the graphics are way better than um, what you're seeing I'm gonna turn my seat warmer on and once the car gets warmer I'll turn on some heat here um, anyhow here's the welcome screen um, what I'm going to do, I'm just going to kind of go through everything. Um, I need to turn on my Wi-Fi hotspot because I am going to run this whole system. Uh, you'll see the, the controls for the um, climate control pop up. It does that briefly. I don't know how to work that yet. I haven't decided. I, I don't know how to get it back up there or anything. My controls, the normal controls, just work just fine. So, um, anyhow, what I'm going to do, I'm going to turn on my Wi-Fi hotspot. I have Verizon. I have... So, everything um, is working perfect. I want to see, I want to show you my dash. The dash uh, is, everything's working perfect on it. No flashing. Um... Obviously, the park brake's on, my seatbelt's off, so I'm sitting in the garage. Okay, so let's just start at the beginning. Um, the navigation, Google Google Nav. Uh, what I always do is... I always change it to satellite view. Yeah, I want, yes, I want always to start in satellite view. So there you go. Um, it works just like uh, your phone and everything, obviously. Um, so if you want to go to, say, Starbucks, Starbucks. Um, Navigate. And there you go. So that works just like um, just like your phone and everything would. Um, see, I'm gonna try and center this a little better here, guys. Okay. Um, now you'll see that this is my Wi-Fi, so I'm running Wi-Fi hotspot. I'm not gonna run um, the Apple Car. CarPlay, obviously I don't have an Apple, or the Android Auto. I, there's no reason to. that I run Hotspot, let this thing do its own thing. It's it's It does everything itself. I don't need to hook anything else up to. So um, this little button right here, that'll show all your screens that are open. So if you have more, you could have multiple windows open, just like it's, it's Android. So um, it works. You could have um, Google Maps running, Waze running. You could have Pandora running. You could have all that good stuff. So uh, next thing I want to go over is the car info. This is kind of what everybody's been wondering. Um, okay, uh, you have your ECU, um, which is the uh, remain uh, range on your gas. Obviously, I'm low on gas. Um, your distance you've gone. Um, I like. I haven't played too much with this yet so oh that's my I guess that's my odometer reading and this is a uh, must be what what I have left on my uh, fuel tank uh, okay you have mileage a so you have your time average speed distant traveled average consumption um, reset so you can blank, clear all that out and then you have your B because you remember you had a and B you can reset that and it will mimic it's what's shown on the dash too when you go to car mode. Um, car settings, here we go. Um, here's all the car settings. Uh, your speed limit, 
speed limit activation, your temperature, I got it Fahrenheit, fuel consumption unit, miles per gallon, instrument panel buzzer volume, I got it on two, automatic door lock, it's on, only unlocking the driver's door, eh, we don't need that, Take that off, independent trunk unlocking, I don't want that, um, stop and go park sensors, I want those because I I live by those in the front. I'll shut those off over there. Um, easy entry activation on. Uh, daytime running light on. Um, distant unit miles. Twilight sensor sensitivity. I got to set it to <clears throat> language set English. Service cycle. Uh, maintenance days. Um, I have. I'm not quite sure how to run those yet. Um, I do, I have an Altel um, professional scanner because um, I do all my service myself. So um, I may be able, I've already done one. I had my green um, wrench come on the dash and I was, I did my oil change and I uh, was able to reset it, no problem. Uh, reset my service. I am going to be doing a major service which is the cabin filter, air filter, um, brake fluid, antifreeze, um, power steering fluid, new belts. Um, I'm going to do the major service on this and I will record all that start to finish on how to do that at home. It's very easy. There's no reason to spend $2,000, $2,500, whatever they charge. Um, you could do it for $500 bucks, and that's using OEM parts, OEM, oil, and all that good stuff. That's another, that's a whole nother video. Okay. Um, well, there, there's all that. So there's all your, your stuff that was on your original one. Radio. We'll go back. We'll get out of that. All right. Bluetooth. Um, I haven't played with Bluetooth very much. Um, obviously, you could hook your phone up for audio. Um, you could hook it up with your phone, your contacts. I mean, it'll do, it'll do so much stuff. I mean, it's something I haven't even, I haven't even, uh, there's your Bluetooth music. So, um, go back. I haven't played with that. That's just something you'll have to play with. I, I don't know. I, I have Pandora on here and I'll show you that. Um, here's the radio. I just started posting more and um, Honestly, like, I'm using my I'm using my buttons on my um, steering column. Posts about you know. So I'm gonna I'm gonna mute that, but um, to kind of show you a couple things here. Um, so you have your your equalizer. It's just a bass, middle, treble, and you can adjust your hertz and everything. Subwoofer, um, loudness on, um, loudness off, loudness on. Um, let's see dimmer obviously you could that and then when it's in night mode you could you could adjust your night mode I suppose uh, language we all know that date and time here's where you set your date and time um, um, it, it's all that's pretty self-explanatory and your and your your date uh, let's see system info tells you're running an Android 8.1 your RAM. Uh, this is a 64 gigabyte. I got 50.91 gigabyte not being used. Uh, let's see. User settings. Um, auto run navi. Track line. Uh, parking sound on. Radar. All that stuff. Touch assistance. Touch screen. ACC volume. Um, reset when breakdown. I, some of this stuff I have no idea. Uh, output image uh, to external display. Um, videos only. Um, the um, USB settings, I they were at mobile connection. I just put them to charge only. I don't know. I, I don't know. Not, I probably won't use that. Um, auto run car when your phone is connected on. Background process, process is on. Okay, and a save and reboot. I guess that's how you reboot it. I don't know. I'm still learning here, guys, so I'm just kind of giving you a rundown of what's, there, what's on here. And then there's more settings. Okay, this goes to all, all you Android users. 
you will know exactly what this is. This is where you go and set your uh, Wi-Fi. Um, obviously, I'm hooked up to my phone. Um, tells all that good stuff. Uh, go back. Uh, connected you, here. It'll tell you what's connected on Bluetooth, your apps, uh, sound volume, storage, all your good stuff. Accessibility updates. You know if there's any updates and stuff. Um, all this and that. So that's your. You know every Android phone tablet has this. So you Android guys will know exactly. Um, what to do there? Let's see. I think <laughs> that was just in this screen. Uh, yeah, that that's uh, that's everything there. So okay. Um, key. I suppose you could you could punch in your frequency there. Um, local stereo, DX stereo, um, mono stereo, search. That's I guess that's a search there too or something. I don't know how all that works yet. A lot of playing to do, a lot of playing, but they're your basic functions here. So we'll get back out of that. Uh, music. I think this is where you could download, you could use uh, it. It's got some stuff preloaded on it. So I think this is where you could, uh, you could use a USB stick or, or something and uh, plug in the USB port and have your music on there. I, I, I will never use this, probably never use it. So this is something you can, um, once again, takes you back to the screen where you could do all your adjustments and stuff. Um, that's something you'll have to play with. I, I, I don't think I'll, I'll even use that. It's just not something I need. So, okay. Um, make sure. Yeah, I got it off. Okay, here's now here's here's the next neat thing. We're going over to the app list. Here we go, guys. This is where all my bread and butter is here. We're just going to start. First of all, I'm going to slide over one. Um, you have your Play Store. Boom. There's everything you want. Everything. Any app you want to put down. If you want Facebook on here, knock yourself out. Um, Amazon, if you want to do a little shopping. <laughs> All that good stuff. Don't know why you would while you're driving. Okay, we're going to go to the app. Here's your maps. That's going to be the same that's already um, installed. So it, you could access it through here or you could ac access it on the main page. Uh, the music player, um, I think this is where this is that same thing. So you can just access it in two different places. Um, uh, now I have Pandora. This is what I use. Uh, I, I have a paid membership. I think it's five bucks a month. So, I guess I can turn some volume on. So it's it's just absolutely, I love Pandora. I'm just a Pandora guy. So it's got everything, all my, all my different things here. So, and now I can, I'm gonna just go ahead and mute that so it's not bothering us here. Um, I'm gonna go down now. It's still, it's still playing. Go back to the app list, so it'll have multiple windows open. Um, radio, that's the radio. That'll take you back to the radio. Um, let's see, let's just do that. Yep, it takes you back to the radio. Let's see if we're still okay. Pandora shut off since I opened that up. Um, we'll go back to settings here in just a minute. I guess we we can go to settings. Um, Oh, let's see. Um, I I do have Waze installed, so there's your navigation options, equalizer again, your dimmer. I think this is all the same thing. I, I've already showed you all this. Okay, never mind. Um, my Waze, gotta love Waze. I do need to log in, but I won't log on here. I'm not logged into my account yet, so go back over there, back. Okay, so there's Waze, YouTube. I love my YouTube, obviously. Um, so, just kind of give you a little demo here. Subscriptions. Well, I, you get the idea, I guess. Um, I'd like to play one. Uh, 
let's see. Let's do, let's do Savage Garage. Just one of my favorites. Savage Garage. Love them. Love these guys. Videos. Let's just play that one right there. Turn on the volume. Skip the darn ad. The, and it's you're running 1080p and the music is just phenomenal in here I just love it the system sounds so good with this radio really sounds good so there you go guys that's that go ahead and shut the volume off um, see if we can stop this here real quick stop it back. I uh, will just do the back button. Back again. Back again. Let's get out of there. Let's go one up. Let's go back. Okay. All right. Back to the apps. It does do exactly what it did on your Android. Okay. Um, and I, you could, you could download any, any app you want. Like I said, Z-Link, I don't know. I, I guess it's for your, iPhone hooking up the iPhone hooking up your Android Auto and stuff. I don't know how that works. I I don't know. It's something you'll have to experiment. And just so you know, like on my camera, it's not showing me. This is just a bright orange. This is so cool. This I'm telling you, the display on my camera is not showing what I am seeing. It is just amazing. So don't don't think that this in my mind, this looks cheap on my recording. But when I'm looking at this in person, it is really crystal clear. So do not go off well what my video is showing as far as graphics go. Okay, let, this is the first page. I'm gonna go back. So this is the, it's getting hot in here now. I'm gonna turn this down. This is really cool. Longitude, latitude, altitude. Uh, it says 14,955 kilometers I don't know I might need to I have to figure out how to reset it on this screen alone but anyhow I mean everything I'm revving the engine it's kind of cool um, I guess that that's all that that does um, like I say I don't know how to it seven degrees Celsius you know it, this is set in a different thing I don't know how to change that maybe there's a way I don't know um, I don't know if I don't, I'm probably never going to use this really, I don't know. Um, auxiliary, there's no signal because I have none, I don't even have them hooked up, so, because I don't need it. Go back, um, Bluetooth, that's back to the screen I already showed you. Um, Bluetooth music, just a one touch Bluetooth music. So if you have your phone hooked up for Bluetooth, you play your Bluetooth music. Um, you have Chrome. You could surf the web if you want to. Um, there's Amazon. Now you could go over here, and if you want the regular um, desktop site, change it. There we go. There's desktop site. Um, let's see. Let's do. This is my bread and butter. I'm not logged in, so this is what I do for a living. I eBay. Um, so anyhow, there's your eBay. I'll probably, I'll actually probably, I'll probably log into my account because I love eBay and I'm always on it, uh, checking my stuff. So anyhow, there's that, which is totally awesome. Um, back into there. So we got Chrome. Then we got a compass. Um, kind of cool. I don't know. I haven't played with this yet. So I, ha I can't drive my car because we have snow on the ground and ice and I have summer tires on this so this car will not move uh, until it gets warm which every now and then here in Nebraska we do get some nice warm days so um, okay DVR 
there's no signal obviously so if you had a uh, the this you can get an optional DVR uh, signal with a kit with this so you watch uh, over there um, stuff TV and everything now one thing that I am gonna do and this I don't know if this is right or wrong I guess I have YouTube so it doesn't matter but I'm gonna download Cody I'm a Cody guy um, so I'll be able to watch any TV show live TV I know how to do the builds and everything so I'll load that on here I can watch anything I want any live sporting event anything absolutely anything so I'll be loading um, Cody on here that's why I don't need a DVR or and the and the signal for that um, Google Earth obviously everybody knows what Google Earth is this is the first time I'm firing it up It'll... okay um, after Google Earth we have easy connection um, I think this is where you will um, hook up your Android Auto and your iPhone uh, but here's your iPhone Wi-Fi, Android Wi-Fi, Android USB. Maybe the Z-Link's where you you put the CarPlay in. I don't know. I I, I don't. I won't use this. Um, there's no reason to mirror system mirror mode. So you could actually have everything playing on your phone on here through Wi-Fi, or because I have Wi-Fi sharing and all this and that too. So I don't know how that works. But there you go. There's your Android Auto. And your iPhone Wi-Fi, and then the Z-Link will do the Car Apple CarPlay. Um, so let's go back, back to the app list. Um, we'll go back to that uh, Gmail. If you, if you want, I don't have my Gmail in here, or maybe I do. I don't remember. Oh yes, I do. Um, okay, so. Um, HD video player. You could download videos. They have a they have a um, Fast and Furious demo on here, which is kind of cool. <laughs> which is so you can watch movies on here too. You could download, put them to a USB uh, stick and plug it in, and there you go. You can download it, or you could just download it on here. You could you could download videos right on here. You have you know a little bit of memory, so you compress them and get them on here. So. Okay, there's your vit that. Okay, here's your file explorer. This is all your. This is gonna be all your files. Your, so you could download your. Um, we'll have to update update that later. Um, so ringtones and alarms, back all this stuff. So there's your um, photos. And I'm guessing, guys, I know we had a lot of people asking, and, and I'm sure you can, and I just haven't messed around with it yet. But you should be able to um, create your own um, login. Uh, so, like, when, when you start your car, your intro, when you start your car, you could, pro you could probably put in your own... Um, so if you want a, the big Maserati emblem or a picture of your car, I was thinking it'd be really cool to get a really nice picture of my car, and that's the first thing you see on here. So that's that's something. I mean, all these folders are empty. It looks like uh, the picture ones, um, but like I say, I, I I don't know. There's the Fast and Furious one, so you could download them right on here. You could use Handbrake and compress them way down and load them on here. It'd be pretty easy. So anyhow, I guess that's kind of the basic functions. I mean, everything works. I mean, I could I could adjust my, um, you know, the way the doors, running lights, uh, the way they unlock your, um, all sorts of stuff. So I, I think everything's on here um, that you ever want to uh, use for as far as um, your car. And and what the neatest thing in the world is is being able to download anything you want. So if there's it, it's just unlimited. It really is. I mean, there's just all your any apps. Um, you could download audio books on here and listen to audio books. Um, so I mean, it, it's great. Like I say, I I'm gonna run my system off my phone, off Wi-Fi. Um, there's no reason for me to use some of the, these features, which there there's just so many on here. Cause I I just love I love just being able to, you know, I I use this all the time. 
obviously when I'm traveling we do a lot of traveling so uh, I'm gonna use this this will be this will my my bread I have ways running this running I'll have my Pandora running now look look at this uh, here's everything that I have open so everything we opened right here so one thing you you do you don't want all these open all the time uh, so I mean if I go back into Pandora here and fire up Pandora so that's all working so and go in here and I could just go up I'll just clear hang out and shuts everything off now everything's off um, so I guess that is the basic rundown of it um, if anybody has any questions you could sure um, shout out uh, send me a shout out um, also um, here's an awesome deal the, the, the guys I've been working with um, through AU car um, they have uh, I guess help me uh, sponsor I guess you could say this this video uh, these videos and um, they told me that uh, anybody who wants to buy one of these systems uh, they could use a promo code and I, I came up with this promo code of Mazi GT cam M A S I G T C A M and if you use this promo code um, they will give you a free um, HD reverse camera is which what, what I have and now I don't have it hooked up guys that's gonna be another video so I will be doing a video on the installation of it of the reverse cam I got everything hooked up to where uh, in the dash so I just need to run the wire so that that's all done um, but anyhow um, and they also will send you free of charge um, an HD dash cam um, so which I think is really cool so you get two things you get the HD reverse cam and an HD dash cam um, using the promo car code mozzie GT cam um, I will attempt to uh, put that up in the video I, I'm very new at this so I'm learning how to edit stuff I, I'm not an expert by any means so I hope this really helps you um, and, and like I say everything works as normal my sport button I mean all this obviously you, you didn't change anything there um, let me turn on the the light here so I could uh, I guess I can't do that right now but anyhow um, everything works uh, heater all that good stuff is working dash is working so um, that is the AU car 9 inch Android head unit uh, with uh, Android Auto and Apple CarPlay, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, and all the goodies on it. So, um, if anybody has any questions, you can get a hold of me uh, either through uh, YouTube or um, on the Maserati forum, Maserati Life, or um, on the uh, Maserati Owners uh, Society webpage on Facebook. So, so that is the whole. Uh, demo that I have that I, I, there might be some stuff that I learn if there are more things that I learn about this system I will uh, post those and, uh, and do do some updates on it but um, I hope everybody has a great weekend and we will talk to you soon